Venus and I can do some melees with the original uh, 14, and we'll try to unlock. I don't think we've used this yet. All right, have we? Well, let's just do like the seven of them, like just in pairs to make sure we get them. Like we can do stock one. I right, start with Fox. Yeah, there you go. It's at the top row. All right, and we'll just do a real quick one here on Corneria. But the idea here is that we use at least, uh, we use all the characters. Now what's gonna happen is, whoever wins the last match that we fight, where we use the final character, the 14th one, that person has to fight Marth to unlock him. So it could end up being either one of us, and it can end up being any of the characters that we haven't used yet. That's what it is in Bowser. Well, Alright now. Just go easy on Mario. This name is named it for me after all. Get off my screen. Ah! Uh, got all the midgets. No, throw him. There you go. I didn't want to attack it. I don't have to throw. No! Ah, uh, Mario is defeated. Alright, beautiful. And now, Pikachu and Ness. Let's do it. Whoops, wrong level. Doesn't matter. Oh, almost ran right off the edge. I thought I was Ness. That's not cool. Come on, big guy. Oh, we both have that same electrical move. <laughs> PK Thunder. Thunder Bolt. Oh, not the bat! Anything but the bat! Makes that scare. Makes that sound. That just the sound of the home run bat is intimidating. Because people associate that with getting the hell smacked out of them. Oh, my phone's ringing. Not cool. We'll ignore it. We know who it is. Gotcha. All right. Let's see who's talking. Hey, Phoenix, wanna take it over? All right. Um. Hey guys. So we're gonna keep going. Friend of ours just goes out. I'm a. We're doing a let's play right now, we're actually recording right now. Alright, so we're gonna just keep going down the line. Just uh, let's do a Pokemon so. Alright, we'll be we'll be on in just a few minutes. Bye man. Alright, so we have one more battle, so hold on. One more battle. Ooh, that's rough. Bowser's Ford Smash is one of the most powerful moves in the game. Um, just normally, if you're not being retarded, it's rather easy to avoid. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, well, there was that fight. Whatever. I'm no good with the ice climbers. To be good, there's a certain way in which you can uh, desync them, get them to stop moving together, which allows for a bunch of awesome combos, but you have to be really good with them. Alright, we're gonna keep going with this. Uh, Kirby vs. Peach. Eric will be joining us on this one in a Dude, that's fucking awesome. This shit is sideways. How the hell does that work? You can do that shit. It's a different level. It's a Sweet. Oh, man. Always oh, some Kirby. Alright! Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> that was nice. Alright, um, yeah, so that's why Pawn Chip plays for Sonic Sign Up. But I can actually do a better, like, bomb jump to chain grab combo than he can. But really, that's about it. I've never seen you pull off a good uh, chain grab on front of this nation yet. In a real battle. I like to practice that. I don't like to do it in practicing. Shit. Beat the shit out of him, DK. Shit. Whoa. Alright, yeah, um, so, this one's not too bad for me since I'm a good bit faster than he is. Uh, damn, walk right into that one. For some daggers, the daggers are fun because they're really hard to see. Um, and for Sheik, like, your biggest power move, as you see, I kept spamming was that forward aerial. Um, which really just blasts him off the side. Your, uh, the front smash, he's always that double kick, which tends to knock him backwards. Alright, and here we are against Marth, and ironically I'm playing as Sheik, who is known in the professional world as the Marth Killer. Unfortunately, I don't really use Sheik, but what can you do? I'm a uh, Marth man myself. I think I can pull it off. And I may go and quiet in this one again, because I don't want to fucking die. Yeah. Poncho has a point. If I do screw up, we can't do it again. This isn't, you know, one that takes an incredible amount of work to do. I mean, pretty much next time we go first, it should mop up again. It's still. Okay, ball. Alright, we got a little chancy. That's fucking useful. It helps the things out. And no, that's not the end of them yet. Gotta, gotta get in the forward aerial. Ah. Marth has got a lot of range and a lot of speed on him with that sword. Um, really, his only weakness is he doesn't have any sort of uh, range moves. There we go. Got him there. And that's the end of Marth. And we now have the, uh, the Swordsman Supreme. There you go. And uh, use him in classic mode. Alright, uh, we're gonna do a quick classic mode with him. Uh, Hello, Oh, really? Okay, so apparently if you play a classic mode with Mark... Could, could, if we do adventure, could we both get both Luigi and Roy? No. No? You can only unlock one character at a time when you get to the end of that. You'll only get one. Alright, well, in that case, I'll just do a classic mode. Roy's cool and all, but he's no Marth. Uh, Marth just, he's got the speed, he's got a lot of nice mirrors, his sword's got good range, and it's much more powerful at the tip. Um, you get more damage and more knockback. Um, yeah. You know what else is more powerful with the tip? And you see. I, you know, she's at 50% and I can take her out with a forward smash. Mars forward smash is awesome. <laughs> I can take her out with a forward smash. Yeah. Alright, so, this one. Not too bad if I, um, sword. Just go for that forward smash whenever you see the opportunity. It's not the fastest move, but for as powerful as it is, it's not too bad. And again, if you get it with a tip, you get a whole lot of knockback. Is the Snorlax mine? I guess we'll never know. Ah crap, I picked up the mine. Awesome, killed him by throwing it away, not actually by blowing it up. And... Oh, we got shot with lasers. And yeah, Falco got lasered to death by his own shit. Uh... We need to do this one, don't we? If you can do it, go ahead. Uh, I'm gonna pass it on to you since you actually know how to do shit. So, I'm gonna pass this on to Ponchi now, he's gonna need the targets for us real quick. Alright, I'm just jumping into the target test here, and I'm trying my specialty. Now, Marth is a real pain. This is one that might take me a couple tries, but I'm gonna go ahead and try to get on, on 
this take right now. Anyway, sort of hop around, smack each one as you go. I mean, you only get uh, two minutes when you're doing it during a uh, classic mode, so you actually have to kind of shorten it a little bit. That one over there on the bottom, I'll show it to you. Down there, that's the last one you gotta get. There's not really a whole lot, whole lot more you can do to recover once you go down there and get that one. Just gonna kind of sneak around these little things. You wanna avoid them as much as you can. And you see the other two are down there. I'm actually gonna go over and down onto this platform to get down to those two. Crap. Almost fell. And use your forward smash to get that one on the right. And you're gonna have to drop to get the next one. Which means we're gonna have to try to time it so we can land on that platform down there. Now, as soon as you land, push down on the control stick. And you'll duck underneath this little thing right here. You can sneak out to the left side of the platform. Use your smash. Duck back down. Now we gotta get to the right side of the platform. Crap. And get over here. Alright, I think we got it. Drop down to this one and smack it. 